isn't funny, Amber. Would you like to play a game, Tara? Doors locked. Doors unlocked. Hello? It's happening. Three attacks so far. Do you have a gun? I'm Sydney Prescott. Of course I have a gun. Something about this one just feels different. Samantha? I'm... I know who you are. I've been through this. A lot. This is your life now, which means that whoever this is is gonna keep coming for you. You ready? For this? Never. Oh, stop! Wait, wait, wait! certain rules to surviving. The attacks were all on people related to the original killers. Whatever his link is to our past, it's pulled us all back here. And I won't sleep until he's in the ground. the beginning. Discover the origin of evil. Why are you back here, Claire? Your conspiracies weren't true when we were kids. They're not true now. We need to expose Umbrella. Watch this. I'm afraid, Claire. I'm afraid of what they're gonna do to this town. You see, Umbrella, they have an incident. I'm talking Chernobyl, if you know what I mean. People are getting sick. You gotta help us, Claire. Let the world know what's really going on. We have to contain this. Shall we go? This is where they're experimenting on him. We should split up. Whenever you're ready. We are shooting a documentary because I am about to meet my first biological relative. She's Amish. I'm not. I am not Amish. What? We are humbled and grateful to have our sister Margot return to us. <laughs> I've always hoped that I could meet you all, so this is a really special moment for me. Hey, mind if I film you for a moment? Hey. I like your doll. What's her name? Yeah. You know, that was my mom's name. She used to live here a long time ago. She's still here. What did you say? Whoa. Why would they build a church all the way back here? What is that? 
demon, Asmodeus, was trapped inside a chosen woman of God. This has happened before. What the hell? Are these from my mom? You can't have me and my baby? I know every Amish family within a 50 mile area. They have faint Amish. Jesus fiat comen, Jesus fiat comen, Christus shanti consu erda. Jesus fiat comen, Jesus fiat comen, Christus shanti consu erda. Oh my god. Are you sure about this? I have to know. <laughs> what is storytelling? Storytelling started with our indigenous people. Can anyone give me an example of a myth or a story they're afraid of? Lucas. What's going on? We found a part of a man in the woods today. Part of the man? I guess the other half was found in the mine. Oh, this has got to be an animal, right? No animal that I've ever seen. Something is going on with Lucas. These drawings belong to a student of mine. This is what was in the mind. It's a diabolical spirit. Excuse me, this is a myth. Well, for you, yeah. He's not your responsibility. He has no one. He is my responsibility. He'll come for me. He needs me. He's here. been gifted this beautiful house. We live here. Can you believe it? Maeve wanted to keep the place in your family, Jamie. We really appreciate the house. Well, then you know. It's got a hole in the roof. The Whelan, they'll do a good job. Jamie, where? You just carry on with your day as if we weren't here. There is one thing I need to show you, and it's a little bit peculiar. Every evening before sunset, she'd leave a blood offering here. Sorry, did you say blood? For who? For the red cups. They'll need feeding. They'll be hungry. Can I get in my own house, please? You own it, dear. How many times have the English come to this country and told us what's theirs is now theirs? They need to know their place. Tim! What did you leave out tonight? Oh, shoot. You can't miss a single day. Hello? Is anyone there? I can't be scared. Not in my own house. 
Don't leave your missus alone with the lads. to your disease. You'll find it. I should have died years ago. Why am I still here if not to fix this? I have a rare blood disease and I'm running out of time. This could be my last chance. You're up to something. What is it? It's not exactly legal. I want to see you get hurt more than you already have. This would be a cure. At what cost? Remedy. Is worse than the disease. Michael Morbius. Got tired of doing the whole good guy thing, huh? What's up, Doc? I'll be home in the morning. Where are you going? I'm staying over at Susie's tonight. What's new? The flyer. The papers call him the grabber. I wish you wouldn't call him that. You don't actually believe that story, do you? Because he can't hear you, and he doesn't really take kids that safe. Oh! <laughs> you goof. <laughs> well, isn't that just peachy king? You need some help? You see that? Yeah. <laughs> Would you hand me my hat? Yes, sir. I am a part-time magician. Are those black balloons in there? Would you like to see a magic trick? I have an announcement to make. One of our students, Finney Blake, was abducted. What if I could help the police find Finney? Since I was a kid. I'll scream. I'll scratch your face. This face? Daddy, I had a dream about it. What happened in your dream? He was taken. By a man with black balloons? Yes. We never released those details. Cable loose from down there. The 
There's a combination lock on the inside of the storm door. What's the combination? I carved it in the wall. Hang up the phone! The tree, the door, the gate. I've never seen it before except in my dreams. You don't have much time. You're going to use a weapon. You raise the phone, step back, and swing. Look what you made me do. Please hurry! You remember what I told you? Someday I have to stand up for myself. Someday is today, Finn. of the universe. Is he man or beast? This creature has been examined by the foremost scientists and pronounced unequivocally a man. I am prepared to offer you folks one last chance to witness this supreme oddity. Where did it come from? Begotten by the same lust and threat that got us all walking on this earth, but gone wrong somehow in the maternal womb. Stop it for living. Is it a beast? Or is it a man? <laughs> Because tonight, you will see him feed. Come on in and find out. Is he man or beast? a little. Apparently it's very difficult to access. At the bottom of this part of the lake, <laughs> there's a perfectly preserved house. Let's go. There she is. Troubles, all the noise and the hurry seems to help. I know downtown. Just listen to the music of the traffic in the city. Linger on the sidewalks where the neon signs are pretty. How can you lose?
guys doing out here? It's Halloween. We've been trick-or-treating. Are you alone? There's a creepy man in a white mask. Where? And he keeps, like, trying to play hide-and-seek with us. Where did you see him? Look! Set the fire. No one told you. <gasps> told me what? Michael Myers is alive. A man couldn't have survived that fire. <laughs> Forty years ago, the boogeyman came for us. We are the survivors of Michael Myers. Lori, what do we do? We fight. Mom, we're family. We'll kill him. We're gonna hunt him down and we're gonna put an end to this. He is not gonna stop killing until we stop him. If you track Michael's victims, that's a straight line to Michael's childhood home. coming for me, but I'm coming for him.